So the questions that you see in this particular form is in a certain order. And if I were to go around onto preview, you can see that whatever question uh, uh, was there in the editing view in a certain order is the exact order that it appears over here in the preview as well. But sometimes, especially in quizzes, you may want to go around and shuffle out your questions as well randomly for different uh, users. So in that case, you can go around onto the three dot button right here. Then you can go around under settings and over here you can see shuffle questions is an option. So you can go around over here and shuffle out all of the questions as you can see right here. So if I were to go around and shuffle all the questions and you can go around onto preview. Now you can see that all of the questions shuffle out right here. You can see that uh, now the number of uh, the number of questions changes out right here. Let me just go around onto back right here and go to preview once more. And you can see that the uh, order of the question changes out once more. But let's say, for example, I want to keep the first question as it is and only shuffle out other question. In that case, I can lock out the question as well. So to do that, I can go around over here onto the three dot button, then go to settings. And over here, you can see lock question is an option. So over here, you can go around and lock, let's say, one to one question. That means it'll only lock out the first question right here from question one to one. If I were to go to preview, the first question remains as it is. But you can see that the second question onwards, it just shuffles it out. You can go around over here on to settings right here. And let's say I want to keep the second question intact. That is, that is which operating system you want to learn and what is your favorite things to do. So I can say question two to three right here. And then if I were to go to preview, the first question changes, but the second and third question remains as it is, as you can see. And that is how you can shuffle out questions and even lock out few questions inside of Microsoft Forms now, uh, uh, when you're collecting responses. So I hope you guys learned something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share and subscribe.